Grandma, it's story time! Story? Who said anything about a story? This story? I guess I could read you this story. I don't know what this says. Sarah, Dad, have you seen my glasses? They're on your head, Grandma. Returning my ball. You must have returned a lot of balls before because you made it look so easy. Balls sure are bouncy and rolly, but I'll try to keep it under control next time. Sincerely, Otter Junior. And they should know when to say, Excuse me. Excuse me. Considerate neighbor. 
It wouldn't hurt others to be kind. Everyone appreciates a kind act, no matter how bad it smells. Oh, and what's that word? Cooperate. Others should learn to cooperate. Did someone say operate? We know how to cooperate. I see others like to play. We. I hope they know how to play fair. Be a good sport. Play by the rules. Take turns. Include everyone. I'd like it if we could share things. Our favorite books. Our favorite activities. <coughs> our favorite treats. Hmm, maybe not the treats. I hope otters won't tease me about my duty do song, my extra large swim fins, my bad hair days. Hmm. I hope otters won't tease anyone about anything. Teasing is mean. It's the worst. It's worse than having a clam shot on your nose. I think otters should apologize when they do something wrong. I'm sorry I used your ear as a tissue. And I hope they can be forgiving when I do something wrong. I'm sorry I called you snotter. Oh, you. So there, that's how I'd like otters to treat me. You see, Mr. Rabbit, I told you it was simple. Right, just do de do onto otters as you would have otters do de do onto you. It's over? Well, I hope you learned from Mr. Rabbit and these sweet little otters what it means to have good manners. And if you have any other questions about good manners, be sure to ask your mom or dad, your teachers, or check out your local library. And remember what Mr. Owl always says, do on to otters as you would have otters do on to you.